Hey everyone, Brent here. I am coming to my raised beds to collect strawberries uh, for winter storage in the refrigerator. And so that's what I'm doing today. You can see here that it's uh, overgrown a little bit. More than a little bit. <laughs> but still have a lot of viable nice green strawberries in there right now that I'm going to pull because I'm relocating them to a different location. And over on this side, there was asparagus. Not asparagus, I'm sorry, artichokes. And this raised bed was the asparagus. Also had some shallots. Looks like the ferns did pretty good this year. Still kind of green. Hopefully we'll get some good eats out of that next year. But, uh kind of neglected this for the majority of the year and I need to get it under control because I don't want to waste the money I spent on strawberries and get some more strawberry plants so I'm going to store them in the house in the refrigerator in the bottom crisper and we're going to do that today strawberries have been removed and the bed is pretty much cleaned up I likely plan shallots here possibly onions next year anyway it's a good bed good soil this is uh, the strawberries laid out on the table I'm gonna try to uh, get this done real quick before the roots dry out and I've got just over 50 there and at the beginning of the season I planted 50 starts and uh, this is what I've got now summer mother uh, plants probably about half mother and half runner so uh, we'll see what we can do this year or this time uh, when I pulled them out I put some in previously is when I'm trying to get out into the refrigerator but I cut all the leaves off and I know when I started them in the fawn they didn't want to take off it quite as well and it seemed to me like the ones that had a little bit of leaves on them they did better so this time for the majority of them, I tried to leave some leaves on them. Now they're packed in their winter home, and this will go in the refrigerator for, well, until spring. And uh, each one of these has a little bit of nutrient uh, water in the bottom. And periodically, I'll go into the refrigerator and shake them up and check and make sure everything's not rotting like I did before. This is home.